to me, there's a different set of rules when it comes to power between men and women. You think about power, you think about sex, and there's definitely a different set of rules when it comes to sex. I got a different handbook to the one that you fuckers were given, right? For example, ladies, you know when you meet a guy and you bring him back to your place and you're about to make love for the first time, and you're all excited, aren't you? But you're a bit nervous, because you're a bit like, oh, hope it fits, ah! <laughs> it does, it's fine. <laughs> I'm actually surprisingly accommodating. I know. <laughs> you wouldn't think it to look at me, but poof, disappears. <laughs> Where's my willy gone? Where's my willy gone? <laughs> I got it, boo, I got it. <laughs> and you have a mad night of passionate sex with this fool, and to be honest, you don't even know his name, right? <laughs> so you're just calling him Hun, but he keeps calling you babe, so fuck it, you're playing the same console, right? <laughs> And then he leaves first thing in the morning, someone's got to drive the bus. Choo choo, see you later. <laughs> and afterwards, you run downstairs, tell your flatmates or your mum, whoever you live with, I'll fuck this dude. She's very proud. And, uh... <laughs> and if you're anything like me, the next day you're like, oh my god, that's amazing. Oh my god, that's amazing. Am I glowing? I've got that glow. I'm glowing, aren't I? I've totally got that glow. No, I didn't even cry. I know, it was amazing. It was so good. <laughs> Oh my god, do you know what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna text him. I'm just gonna text him. But your friends, like my friends, they're like, text him. What's like, You can't text him. Don't text the guy. Never text the guy. You're joking, babe. Je <laughs> Don't text the guy. You can never text. Jeez, no wonder you're single in your 30s. This is what you've been doing your whole life. Never text the guy. <laughs> Men are very simple creatures. They won't like that. Men do not like being chased. You've got to let the man come after you, okay? You've got to let the man be the alpha male. So, what does that make me? Omega 3, I'm not a fish. <laughs> And then, like, if you text him, that's really inappropriate. Oh my god, that's so awkward. Oh my god, why would you? Oh my god, that, I feel a little bit. Oh my god, I feel sick for you. Louisa. Like, <laughs> you can't take that's really too awkward. That's so forward. Oh my god, that's so forward. That's so awkward. Louisa, you can't take. No, just don't. Okay. Oh, okay. Let me just break it down because I would hate to get it twisted. Um, this man, um, fucked me so hard he gave me a seizure. <laughs> <laughs> Yet sending him a text message <laughs> is too forward, is it? <laughs> I need to be a bit more honest just so you can really see the difference of what we're talking about. This stranger <laughs> pounded me so vigorously, <laughs> I squirted all over his bed sheets. <laughs> I'm gonna say it again because I feel like you missed it the first time. <laughs> this, this stranger. Honestly, I squirted all over his bed sheets. We spent the whole night rolling around trying to avoid the pond life that was going on in the middle of the room. <laughs> Yet sending him a text message, <laughs> which is free on my price plan, PSFYI. <laughs> oh, that's where it gets awkward, is it? Is that where it gets awkward? I don't think so, bitches. Come on now, I can't text the guy. I sucked your dick dry. I think I can text you. Jog on, mate. <laughs> Be clever about it, right? You've got to be clever about it. You can't text him a statement, he won't reply to a statement. You've got to give him a reason to reply, so you've got to text him a question. So I'll be like, <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> so I'll be like, Okay, think of a question, but be breezy. Think of a question, but be breezy. Hello, Louisa, breezy, I'm there. It's my own. So I'll text him, be like, Right, okay, I've got it. His message is really good. Right, here we go. So I'll be like, um, uh, Hi, hon, uh, babe here. So, um, <laughs> how long does it take to boil an egg? <laughs> Send now. This is actually genius, right? Because you're hoping he'll look into the subtext, realise that you're in your 30s and ready to start making some babies! Eggs, 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 eggs! Or... If he's a bit slow, he'll just think you're hungry. So either way, you're hoping he'll text back relatively quickly and let you know that he's interested. Ladies in the audience, think back to the last time that you were in the situation. Does the boy text back straight away? No. Three days! No. What the fuck have you been doing for three days? <laughs> and when you finally get the message back, is it ever worth the wait? Ah, oh, hell no, bitches, hell no! <laughs> when you finally get that message back from him, do you ever read it and go, Well, thank God that took him three days. <laughs> Does the message you get back ever say anything along the lines of, Oh, I don't know, um, hi there, Louisa. Yeah, I actually found out your name when I googled beautiful. <laughs> <Thank> you. <laughs> 
oh, shut up, I love that joke, it's my favourite joke. <laughs> when I wrote it, I was really excited. I was like, yay, well done me, you can have a biscuit. <laughs> <laughs> They're so good, you should have the whole pack. <laughs> Listen, sorry I haven't been in touch. It's my mum's birthday, so I surprised if I take him to the airport for her and her friends for a holiday. I've just got a great relationship with my mum. Um, it's not she's not overbearing or anything, we just, I just respect women. And, um... <laughs> Uh, the other night was really unlike me. I just, uh, well, I have been avoiding relationships. Not on purpose, I've just decided to really work on my own sense of self and really make sure that <laughs> I'm the kind of guy that gets to a place that, like, I'm emotionally mature and ready so that when I meet the kind of woman that I'm meant to be with, that I make sure that I'm the man that I'm meant to be to, like, deserve the woman that I'm meant to be with. <laughs> so I've just been really working on myself and, like, you came along, like, like wow, I just wasn't ready for it, Louisa. And then <laughs> I haven't been able to stop thinking about you since. And then um, I hope you don't mind, but I've gone ahead and been a bit assertive. Ah, oh, I hope you don't mind. Um, <laughs> I just decided to use my loaf for a bit, and um, I booked a table at number one Oriental Buffet on Friday at 8 o'clock. Because uh, <laughs> right? I hear it's your favourite. Well, I don't know if it's your favourite, but they had, like, a picture of you in the window, so I assume <laughs> uh, you'd won a competition, right? <laughs> so I booked a table there, and I'd love to take you out on Friday and just get to know you better as a person. So, <laughs> let me know if you can make it, because it would make my day if you, um, if you could. Um, love from, uh, Hercules. Kiss, kiss, kiss. <laughs> That's never the response, is it? It's never the response. The message that I stopped getting on any public transport and I stopped getting on trains because I didn't want to lose my mobile phone reception for any period of time <laughs> that I waited three days for, that I finally get back from this fall is, uh, five minutes, full stop, no kiss. Oh, really? <laughs> Really? That's what I was waiting for, really. <laughs> now, apart from the fact that the guy's a complete fucktard and cannot cook for shit because everybody knows it's three, do I breathe before I respond? Do I think to myself, do you know what, Louisa, you've seen the film he's not that into, you've also read the book twice. Let it go. No. <laughs> no, no, no. Let the games begin, bitches. Let the games begin. <laughs> <laughs>